lovelies welcome to my first YouTube video so for my first video I will be doing a get to know me kind of thingy I'll be doing a get to know me video so here are the questions I asked a few of my friends to send me some questions that they would ask me if they had no idea who I was who I am if they had no idea who I am so I have 17 questions and the first one is where are you from I am from Kingston Jamaica I grew up in Clarendon was born in St. Anne I moved to Kingston when I was starting sixth form and wanted to live with my mommy so here I am today still stuck in Kingston barely go to Clarendon and the next question is what would you change about yourself if you could I would not change anything about myself you see the thing is I struggled to love the person that I am today and because of that and to see how far I come up from I really appreciate myself now and the type of person that I am kind and it's genuine just that sweet loving angel the third question would you be oh sorry who would be your ideal partner I guess they're talking relationship relationship why so my ideal partner would be someone who is my ideal my ideal partner would be someone who is genuine who is honest who is um smart brilliant who is very intelligent and somebody who gets me somebody who understands my needs somebody who loves the lord and is willing to hold my hand to pray whenever i want to and let's go to the next question because i'm getting carried away the next question is who or what inspired you to start a youtube channel what inspired me was really my blog and i really wanted to start this youtube channel for my work about in second year and my blog just so I started a blog, I've, I've been writing a lot, especially COVID-19, so I've been writing a lot and I just realized that most of the things that I write I can actually say it as well because not everybody loves to read and I'd like to reach as much people as possible with the wisdom that, that God blessed me with. Uh, what is your age? I am 22 years old. I um, celebrated my birthday, I think last week. Last week was the 28th of June, right? Yes, I celebrated last week and I really had fun. I enjoyed it. You only get three words to describe yourself. What are they? I think I already said it. Genuine, very intelligent, and very determined. I'm a very determined person. I must stress that. If I say I'm going to do something, I am going to do it. And it, it's going to... I'm just going to do it. Stop love. I'm just going to do it. I am kind of a stubborn person when it comes down to doing what I want to do and getting it done. What really makes you angry? I what makes me hang, angry is when people er, hurt people that I really love. When people break promises to me that they made to me, and when I want something and I can't. When you're, when you're at a position where you can afford to get something but you really really want it so that makes me angry especially when I see that I want to help people but I can't help it what motivates you to work hard I really love this question what motivates me to work hard is really my family my friends and just myself I want to be in a place where I can help people and I'm not in that right now so i really really want to help them you know when somebody said that they want something from you or they want help but you can't help and you really want to and you just feel so angry like i said before this makes me angry i really want to be out of that position and where i can help them i want to change that and it's going to happen in time what is your favorite thing about your career i am starting my career for you so what I am looking for 
forward to in my career. I am a journalism student of final year one and I'm looking forward to just writing stories that will make impact, stories that will make changes, stories that will affect people in a very positive manner. So I'm looking forward to all the adrenaline that it comes with. I really like keeping busy at my feet and just going here and there and just being organized at the same time. So I'm really looking forward. The next question. If money was no objective or object, what would you do all day? I, I've always wanted to travel. So I want to go places with my family and friends. And I just want to laugh without worrying about what is going to happen tomorrow or what is going to come. So I really want, want that. And so if I get the opportunity, I'd go on a cruise, I'd go on a plane. And of course, here we're saying that money is no objective because I guess money wouldn't exist so I wouldn't have to pay, pay for plane tickets or cruise tickets or hotel um, fees or anything like that. So I'd really just be living my best life, traveling with all the people that I love. If you could go back in time, what year would you travel to? I would travel to the year when my grandmother died and I would tell her the things that I would love to tell her today. She raised me and my um, younger sister, not young sister, and she really did a good job. Um, as you can see, the type of person that I am so far from all the questions that I answered, she really, really did a good job and I would tell her how much I really appreciate everything that she did for me and how much I love her and how much I want to make her proud because as I can tell you if she was here today she would be very proud and I'd just hug her and I'd listen to her stories about when she was growing up and all of that if I had the chance to go back to that year and the final question I think I'm going to end it on this question because I really love this question and it's a good place to end especially for since this is my first video so the question is what does the name of your channel mean? what does the name of my channel mean? the name of my channel is She Forges and it means that I'm, I'm looking forward to things change beautiful changes forge, forging into amazing things and see what where this channel can go and where the content can go and the impact it's basically also the name of my blog so i guess this channel is in conjunction to my blog so that's it those are all the 70 questions and i hope i answered them good enough for all of you so until next time and I'm really looking forward to all the good things that are going to come from this, cha this channel. So I will see you guys in the next video. So what do YouTubers normally say? Like, comment, and subscribe. And tell a friend, 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 friend to subscribe to this channel. Bye.